Okay, there we go. Uh, hey guys, uh, how's it going to those who just arrived on the live? I also just arrived here carrying my uh, dinner with me. Um, be sure to pull in some people as well to watch the stream while it's going on. Uh, as an overview for those who are kind of familiar but at the same time not familiar, we're going to be covering main story more because like I mentioned on the Discord server, that we're gunning after the other Sauri mission. By the way, um, due to technical difficulties of the network, we're kind of running at half the bit rate, somewhat, I think. I don't know if this is going to restabilize uh, sometime soon, but since we're running at half the bit rate, it's not going to be on smooth 60 FPS. So this would be on a fluctuating 30 fps uh, stream for the time being this is beyond me but at least i'm not below a megabyte per second that's the only uh thank thank sorry moment that i could mention and by the way uh just shameless plugs here if you guys don't know i also have a discord server here um kindly pm or message on chat here those who want to be part of the discord server you know what let me just let me find the invite. Give me a moment. Uh, let me try to throw an invite as well. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where do I copy the link? Uh, no, not here. Uh, where was it? Right, from the welcome lounge. I kind of forgot that that's oh no it's the read me welcome okay wait so i'll have to throw in the invite here uh wait members copy link this is temporary link uh for y'all just to let you guys know ahead of time we have a permanent link that we could share i might need to pin the news i might need to pin a new message to uh let most people people know if you want if y'all want to invite people into the server and enjoy our craziness of both racing, animo, Kasumi, and anything Sega meme worthy, you just you we have a universal uh, invite link. Okay, let me drop this here. There we go, and I am going to how to pin. How can how can I pin myself? Could somebody pin this for me? Oh wait. So somebody there we go. Now I see it. There. Okay, message has been pinned. So most of y'all would be able to see it. And also, um, don't forget to leave a like as well during the session of this stream. As we go about more of the main story. So to to recap. For those who are familiar with uh, the progression of our Let's Play of Judgment. So, it turns out that Ayabe, the detective who's been leaking info for us, is now charged with the murder of Shintani. We're off the hook. But at the same time, it also makes us the designated lawyer for uh, Ayabe. Because we, we know he was with us. He was... If he's going to be charged with anything, it's breaking and entering, not murder. And on the side contents, yes, as we dolled up Sauri for the past two judgment streams. She doesn't want to do it no more, but I already spoiled a bit on the server saying that there is another Sauri moment. In addition, and this is a shameless plug, I'm not paid to do this. For those in the Philippines out there, on select SM Cinemas, Gundam Seed Freedom will start airing their general screening of the movie on April 24th. I recommend those in Mall of Asia, SM North EDSA, and Mega Mall for ease of transportation access. I'd recommend you guys to go to those malls to check out the movie. And if you're in the provincial areas, there are also options so just check out sm cinemas for more details it is definitely this is very generous of me it is definitely a nine out of ten of a film and if anything it really might be just the anime movie of the year and, and we're just entering second quarter but okay so shameless plugs aside 
and um, shameless plug, uh, shameless plugging of my fan base aside, let us actually continue on with our main story campaign. So we have to meet Matsugane, who was our technically our godfather. Would this give me heat? Okay, good. We're we're not given heat. That's good. Okay, guys. Just just like a just like a reminder. If ever the landlady comes in and puts some food in my fridge, you guys are free to raid the fridge. All right. Just let me know via PM if the if the fridge is empty. Got that? Okay, good. Okay, so which way do we go again? Matsugane, Matsugane. Wait, let's pass by Senryo Avenue first. And Matsugane's, Matsugane's place is at... Oh, we forgot we have sub-stories here, too. Find a way to meet Matsugane. Do ya how? That's the question. Do we meet up with Kaito? Do we meet up with... Uh... Oh wait, wrong way. We meet up with Kaito. Do we find uh who was his face again? Hamura? I think I got most of the people right, most of the information correctly. Oh yeah, I forgot. I need to report into Dear Ezio Auditore. Hi, do you want to do a quick job? These are the jobs I got so far. You're repeating the very exact thing. Yes, yes, I know. Now pick! I'll send the client's location to the map on your phone, so head to where the key icon is. And no, you cannot binge collect all of these jobs. You have to do them one at a time. Got it. I'll get going then. Says no one ever. <laughs> but we're going to do the sub-stories first. I forgot, we have unlocked new sub-stories. So this is our moment to- God damn it, guys! Oh, you know what? I'm low on heat. Give me. Give me. Give me. And thank you. Shibaraku netokette no. Tanoshikatta de gozaru yo. Ooh, an up. Oh, a play pass. Nice. Alright, so we'll at least clear off these uh, two sub stories and play Cupid once more before we continue on our main quest. Who do we bump into this time in the middle of the street? God damn it! I'm busy! I nearly read it as Kido, I was gonna say Balls Out Kudo instead. Okay, good. And great. We go to our story on Tatsuya Gamo, the escaped convict from Hokkaido's Abashiri prison. Convicted of murdering a member of a criminal organization three years ago, Gamo's sentence has only just begun. However, Police are calling for caution after he was found to have escaped at dawn for the 5th of last month. According to reports released by Tokyo PD today, there is no reason to believe that he may be sheltering in Kamurojo. Authorities are asking that any sightseeings of Gamo be reported immediately and urging citizens to take precaution. It's worth noting that there is a 1.2 million yen reward for info that leads to his capture. Bur what? Burger Fugitive? Yikes, another day in the life here in Kamurocho. Would suck to run into that guy. For a reward that big, probably worth keeping an eye out. Yeah, at least. Alright, uh, search for Gamo. How about no? We'll go to this for Oh wait, right, we're in the area, so might as well, might as well. Cafe. Alright. Spill the tea. Oh, wait, right, ma'am, first. Yagami san, guess what? Well, hey, Miyaro chan. What's going on? 
Okay, okay. Let me show you the receipt first and I'll tell you all about it. Yagami-san. Right, Yagami-san. Check this out. Mm -hmm. Commence checking. Just like you predicted, I got invited to the aquarium. <laughs> Told ya. So, who's the lucky guy? Actually, it was Norimoto kun. Can you believe it? Amazing. What a coincidence. We were talking in the back, and all of a sudden, he told me he happened to get some aquarium tickets. Isn't that crazy? You did well, Norimoto kun. You're on the blessed path. Yeah, it's your aquarium dream come true, isn't it? Enjoy that date. <laughs> oh, it's nothing like that. We're just going as fr Did I say blessed? Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Give me a moment here. Alright, this is what I say to you, Norimoto-kun. Damn ads! Well, as much as I want to dick around and mess with Norimoto Kun's failed luck, I also have to admit the fact that it's quite too early for them to jump into the whole relationship wagon. The two of you and an aquarium. All by yourselves. Sounds like a date to me. Well, when you put it like that. Jeez, now I'm getting all nervous. Thanks a lot, Yagami. Oh, what should I wear? <laughs> hey, now, I was just teasing. Don't think too hard about it. Just be yourself and focus on having a good time. Yeah, you're right. That's good advice. Hey, one more and we're besties. Thanks for the meal, Miyaru-chan. Hope you enjoy the aquarium. Thank you. Oh, by the way, be wary of Norimoto-kun's shark. His what? Oh, no, nothing, nothing. He was just gloating about it. He may be gloating about it. All right, where were we? All right, the other sub story. Oh, wait, it said burger, so maybe I encounter him at a burger shop. Oh. Yosuke. Uh, Yagami-san, have you seen Sakino by any chance? No, I haven't. Something wrong? Came out shopping with her, but we got separated. Huh. That's concerning. Ah! Well, speak of the devil. Was that a scream? That was Akino. I think it came from the back alley. Let's go. Back alley, back alley. Oh, this back alley. Okay, we went the wrong way. Come on, Yosuke. Are we? Yagami-san, it came from the ch from the park. What are you talking about? Oh wait, right. No. Oh oh oh. Come on, Yagami-san, I can't do parkour. <laughs> hey yo, them bottom G's though. Nani? What? Hey, yo, what the f- What am I looking at? Beats me, Yagami-san. How about chat? What is chat looking at? Are you guys seeing anything? Wait, Yosuke, who are you talking to? I told you we're talking to the chat. The, the what now? Oh, no. Uh, another pervert. What the hell did you do to Sakino? Peace, friends. I assure you. <laughs> I assure you. 
I'm just a perfectly innocuous gentleman. You're far from innocuous from that's what I'm seeing. <laughs> I simply want to introduce the young lady to my sweet, innocent son. Hey, yo! Bro, you know, you know, like she just graduated, right? Uh, how old is she again? Oh, she's legal. Oh, okay. And, and it's a Tuesday for her. Excuse me, Yagami son. What kind of gentleman looks like you? <laughs> Who are you? A twisted trio copycat? How dare you put me in the same league as those debauchers, sir? I am the prince of perverts, the emperor of exhibitionism. Giant impact. Pardon? Hey, Yagami san, you know he's standing right there. Yeah, yeah, I, I am shocked in disbelief. I don't know what to counter that with. Eh? Giant impact. The perfect king! <laughs> Is that a Genshin roast? I heard of him, Yagami-san. He's the newest pervert to stain the streets of Kamarosha. Wait, there's more? Ho oh, oh. ho! It seems my reputation precedes me. Hey! Wait! Tsukino! You're right. Did he hurt you? Uh, uh, I'm okay. He just showed me his his genitals. The piece of crap! How dare he show my innocent sister his junk? We should file a police report, you two. Oh, we should file a police report, you two. Any clue how that pervert found you, Sakino-san? Yeah. No, no idea. He he came out of nowhere, threw back his coat like some sort of yakuza, and he was naked underneath. So you saw it, the whole thing, from the shaft to the bulge. Uh, too much information, Nissan. Yeah, I tried not to look. That mother. What kind of monster goes around showing poor girls as Packer? Reminds me of that time me and Sakino accidentally saw our fathers and he was Okay Yosuke, I'm gonna stop you right there Too much information Shoto. Hey Nichan, let's not! I take it as earned the name Giant Impact, right? Yeah, he's a fresh face on a pervert scene Some out figures he'd find Sakino of all people I guess an exhibitionist was bound to be next on the list. Yeah, lots of rumors about this guy lately. People are too embarrassed to say his name though, so they call him G.I. You know, I think that's kind of worse, Yosuke. What do you mean, Yagami-san? If you look closely at the eye and the two periods that they built- Yagami-san! Too much information, Yagami-san! But I'm curious. Was he really that big, Sakino? Why are you asking? For science! Research! To compare his to mine and see if it will build or ruin my self-confidence! Excuse me, what? Would you say he was bigger or smaller than Dad's? Let me think. Wait, why are you thinking about this, Sakino? Wait, I don't want to think about it! Don't be gross, Yosuke! How notorious is this guy at this point? Or is he on par with the Trista Trio? Eh, sort of. So people seem to think he was their leader. That's why he calls himself the Exhibitionist Emperor. Eh? Exhibit? I I'm not even gonna finish that sentence. Come on. Word on the street is that he's really massive down there. So he's developed some kind of fan base of would-be perverts. Uh, I guess you have to be pretty big to call yourself an emperor. And how did you know this, Yosuke? Uh, reasons? Yagami-san, 
Yagami-san, you're not going to let this monster keep whipping this thing out in public, are you? I guess not, but... Then it's settled. I'll even fund you on this. The usual 50,000 yen. You know what, with what I'm earning right now, that's kind of very low-balled. Damn it! What's wrong, Yagami-san? I fell for a GI joke! You have to avenge Sakino's innocence! Alright. Guess I'm on the case. Great! But... Any ideas how you catch this one? Mm, uh, huh, let's see... Oh look! I'm doing the opening cinematic pose! <laughs> we'll need to try to predict where he's going to show himself next. You seem to have this guy's number, Yosuke. Any idea where he's been? Naturally! And how did you know this? Reasons? <laughs> My poor sister's a pervert magnet, so I have to stay up to date on this nonsense. Excuse me? A knee chan what? <sighs> what is it about me and that draws every pervert in the city in my direction? Anyway. I'd say the largest concentration of sightings were on Shichifuku and Nakamichi Street. Okay, so it's before M-Side Cafe and around it. That's where the Panty Professor and Ask Catchem were active too. In fact, I think those turfs open up is what opening up is what gave GI his in. They have turfs? What? Don't don't tell me. East Coast for the panties. West Coast for the asses. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. West Coast is for Judge Peep and Creep. Uh, down South for the asses. And you know what? Why am I overthinking this? Yeah. Apparently, the Twisted Trio hated it when other perverts would try to muscle in on their turf. What is this? Need for Speed Carbon Hentai? Why do perverts have a social ecology? But if his exhibitions can be traced, why hasn't he been caught lately? That's the thing. He seemed. It seems he moves on once he caused enough of a commotion in one area. I see. I guess he's pretty cautious despite his appearance. Hmm, if we can analyze this pattern, we might be able to figure out where he'll go next. Great idea! Let's put our thicket caps on! Where would. Why are we overthinking this? How about here? This was the area the Panty Professor worked in. There are already reports of him appearing there, so that's probably out. Mm, that's true. So Gia, so Gia has already exhausted his time in Panty's turf. Then the next likely place would be... Mm -hmm. The hotel district? Yes, Gia is taking advantage of the Twisted Trio's empty turf, which means... Judge Peep and Creep's old stomping ground is ripe for the taking right now. Oh, I see! <laughs> really smart, Yagami-san! I guess I'll stay at the hotel district for a few and see what I can find. Thank you! I'll look forward to the report! Hmm. Why am I invested in this? Is it because someone wants a dose of salary and ends up getting this instead? Ah, oh, good theory, Mr. Kitty. I never thought of it that way before. Okay, so we're definitely going around in that direction. Wait, another one pops up? Oh, wait, I, right, I forgot the date with Nanami. Okay, so we may not be doing main story at this point. <laughs> Sultan, everyone I knew, everyone knew I needed Saori Reina. Don't hurt me. <laughs> no, I don't have to. I don't. I don't have time to fist any of you guys. Wait, what? I mean, I don't have any time to fight you guys. I'm here for. I'm here for some giant impact. Oh my god, chonks. 
You know what? I want my dose of Brazil. Get over here. Come on, get over here. No, no, no. Bring it over here. Bring it over here. No, don't touch me. Go to the Philippines. Not my fault, he kind of walked into that one. And boom. Nah, he'll live. Average <laughs> Manila outing. <laughs> Oh, come on, guys. Oh, wait, right. Get closer. What did you learn? Uh, bro. Bro. I think I hit him too hard. All right. I have a good view of the hotel district from here. Okay. Now to wait for our guy. G.I. was as cautious as I suspect he is. He'll be on high alert even though this area is primed for him. He probably tried to hide his features, so I need to look carefully for features he cannot conceal. Mm. No, I know this I know this dude right here. Wait, cat? Oh, that's an easy one. Oh, look, a cat. A well-built bald man. If I was a well-built bald man, which way would I go? Oh, no, wait, never mind. That's just Ryan. Salutations, Yagami-sama. Hmm, that guy's bald, but... Sunglasses and a mask. Talk about a sussy baka. Not to mention how he's ogling all these women. WHAT WOMEN?! I'll follow him for a few. Oh, is it because- Oh, there's a lady right there, I see. Nah, it doesn't match the profile. This isn't our guy. Who else is there? Other than the cat. Hmm? Nah, he doesn't match the profile either. Are you the pervert? Salutations, Yagami-sama. What are you doing here? I'm just investigating. Ah, preserving your chakra, I see. Good on you to master the way of the Nin. Okay, whatever, Ryan. Ha! Huh? We may have uh, we may have had a wrong guy. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! We may have had a, a wrong guy. <gasps> ah no! You saw nobody. We saw no one. But he's all clothed. We may have had the wrong guy. But he does seem to look very sussy. Move, good sirs. I'm losing my target. Game, stop giving me the suspenseful music. I can see him from here. All right. 
Oh, he nearly stopped. He nearly stopped. Okay, if I go over this side, he would not notice me. Surely he wouldn't suspect someone committing parkour. Ow. Oh my god, so close. Where are you? Oh god, no! Yagamino. Oh, he's running. Our boy is running. Our saucy old man is running. I didn't say parkour over the ledge. No! No! No, 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 parkour! How does he have eagle eye vision? It's, a, it's the dead of the night! Ah, you thought, aha, uh -huh, you thought. Should have gotten the vampires. You know what? Ah, no, we can't. We can't disguise ourselves as the as as Count Yagami. We cannot put a disguise on. No, <laughs> no. Okay, so he went down there. Uh huh. Oh, an alley, another alleyway. Is he meeting someone? Yeah. Uh oh. Hey. Okay, she's knocked out. It's you. Have you come to bask in the shadow? <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't, I can't read this with a straight face. <laughs> in the bask of my shadow of my scrotum totem. Y you're what? Ah! Oh, is that a leaf? <laughs> you are not welcome around my son. The exhibitionism emperor's gates do not open for men. Wait, 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 so are you telling me? In front of women, that openly pops out out of nowhere. And when you face a guy, it automatically conceals itself? By the way, ma'am, are you okay? Uh, How many fingers am I holding? Uh, if you're okay, speak. Big! <laughs> Saraba. Ah, ew, it has man grease. No, I am not letting you get away. Okay, this is the most this oddly disturbing. It even ow. It even disturbs the cars. <laughs> oh, what the hell was that guy pass? Ow! Why was that guy passing by? Why is he butt naked? Uh, long story. Where would he go? Oh, there he is. Oh my god, the parkour. Hit! 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 This takes streaking to a whole new level. Stop laughing. Wait, which way did he go? Oh. oh my god, did he just go through? 
Ow! Stop declaring yourself to be Giant Impact! We get it! Your Badongers is big! Stop talking about your enormously huge Holy Dong! I get- Ew! Ah, ew! Ew! Why did I touch that? Why did I group you? Ew! Ew, all the mangries. Ew! Ew, what did I just touch? <sighs> How dare you touch my son! I didn't touch anything! I have you cornered. Time for you to give up. Huh? Why so shocked? Surprised to discover the giant impact of such an old man? Imagine having a body like this at 78 and a son so magnificent. Are you not in awe? You're 78? You're 78? Sona Bakana. You are but hairless, swaddled babes before me in my man <laughs> Now, face the power of 78 years of perversion. Perpetual perversion, ceaseless creeping. I, Shinzaburo Ishikawa, am your opponent. I am going to be scarred. Sh crap. Wait, you know what? Hold on. Let me dance. Can your child do this? Ow. No, tell me. Can your child take this? Oh god, that's not enough. Can your child swag like this? Uh, oh my god, I... He, ow. Oh, not my child, not near my son. <laughs> no. No. Ah, uh, no. Not the ew right through the hole that right through the peeping hole no 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 Stop high kicking I can see your son ew No no You know what I am disturbed as Get out No Be <laughs> No you know what? I've had enough of this. This is too graphic for my taste. Ow, no. Oh, look what you made me do! You made me... Okay, that's it. The power of Chi! Oh wow, nice throw, bro. Wait. Okay, time to settle this. I don't want you man spreading in my town. Ah, oh, thank you, censorship. Say, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> so it's true that you're the one to defeat the twisted trio. And now I too have fallen limp. Bro! Just tell me why. Why would you go around exposing yourself like that? Very well. You defeated me. You earned an explanation. Let my son do the talking. No, I want to hear it from you. Leave your son out of this. To tell you the truth, I'm actually a virgin. 
Can you repeat that? Eh? Seriously? Yes. Even at this age, I am a celibate as a child. My massive phallus has never known another's pleasure. Has never touched another lips. Has never even felt sun to sun. You know what? You better stop talking about your son, bro. Okay. I tried everything to win the favor of the ladies. I sculpted the body you see before you. But it was no use. I began to despair. It was a tragic irony. How could I die before utilizing such... <laughs> <laughs> Cameraman, please change! So, I loosed my son upon the world. I see. Except not really! I can't even begin to understand that logic. Huh. The shrieking of those women. That was the only way my son felt alive. But... All things must end. My regrets are many, and yet they hardly matter now. Was that pause appropriate? Uh. Well, he lived as he died. He's fallen limp. Yo, wait, me! What the heck, me? Whoa, well, hey! <sighs> oh, I guess the fighting took a lot out of him. Yes, my son. Be free. Be free to roam and make every woman scream. Okay, now he's sleep talking. So, G.I. was actually a senior citizen? I guess all that pent up testosterone finally cracked him at, th at that age. I almost feel bad for him. 78 years of isolation? Who wouldn't become a monster? If he'd found love. Maybe things would have been different from him. <sighs> hey, let's not turn this to a pity party for a pervert, Yosuke. Don't forget that I'm the victim here. Hello? I saw his junker? Well, I didn't. But you fought him, Yagami-san. Well, he has this one weird feature that whenever he faces men, a giant leaf pops in out of nowhere. So? All I saw was... Yep. Raw and adulterated. Oh my gosh! I just sympathize with the guy. He's everything he wanted to become. Excuse me? Well, you know where to find me if any more perverts come out of the woodwork. Although, I'd say we've done our fair share in that department. Yes, thank you so much, Yagami-san. Okay, good. Yosuke, despite being a closet pervert, knows how to say thank you. Well, that was a weird, weird, um, sub-story, isn't it, Mr. Kitty? Meow. Wait, are you saying I'm on the same league as Giant Impact? Meow. No, 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 don't you lump him next to me, okay? I'm at least clothed. Meow. Oh, yeah, right. Thanks for reminding me about Nanami. Speaking of Nanami... Wait, is this the one here? ANOTHER ONE?! <laughs> he really had his inner peace! I'll go this way first. <laughs> Miss Ben's like, yes, join to the pony side. 
Oh, it's inside here. Oh. Okay, so I have to go inside. I have to come in. Ah, uh, all right now. Uh, it's no problem at all. Honey, who are you uh, talking to? How long are you gonna be on the phone? Uh, don't worry, sweetie. Uh, it'll be just a second. Uh, uh, no, Captain. I wasn't calling you, sweetie. Wait, you want me to call you that from here on out? Uh, I mean, yes, of course I'm at home. I was talking to my uh, cat. I was talking to my cat. I'll head over right away. How dare you spend your wife's birthday on the phone? <laughs> Oh, wait a... Another class of the good stuff and make us happy. Uh, 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 no, that's not the voice of a drunk woman. Uh, the TV is on. It's loud. I'm totally at home right now. I'm watching, um... Um, Drunk Bitches Live. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's what I'm watching. Make it a point not to get too close to drunks and that lady is... Plastered. You know what, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna talk to the dude. Oh, oh no, don't tell me. Who is this from? No, Kim. Not right now. Hey, you. Hmm? Huh? Me? Yes, you with the dumb face. Come here and take my load off. What? I mean take a load off. I'm drunk. Give me a break. Eh? Uh, why would I? I said I have a seat! How long you gonna make me drink alone? But, but I'm... And I ended up drinking more than two bottles with her. Don't keep your wife waiting on her <laughs> birthday. Crap, this is what I get for thinking about keeping my distance. How long has she had anyway? I know. Okay, um. Did you need anything? Stop with the nonsense. I'm your wife, and don't you keep your wife waiting on her birthday. My wife? That's me. I'm sweet, petite, and I. Now go! Sakahashi? No, no, wait. Far from it. Are, are you like her mother? Eh? But, but we're not me- How did she jump to the conclusion that I'm her husband? Hey. I'm sorry, I have to use the restroom real quick. Ah! Hold your horses! That's her Hey man, aren't you that drunk lady's husband? Yeah, uh, sorry, I had to hide for a second. Uh. What the hell is going on? I'm just as shocked as you are, buddy. Looks like she thinks you're me. Uh. She's so drunk she could mistake me for her husband, that's a problem. Oh, I agree. She's both wasted and nearsighted. And that is a dangerous combination. Got her makeup done to the nines and no glasses, or she's blind as a bat right now. Why is she drinking so heavily then? Well, you may have heard her ranting, but uh, it's her birthday today. The thing is, my work keeps calling, so I've been on the phone this whole time. She's kind of pissed about it. Within reason, I guess. What did you do anyway? Can't you tell from looking at me? I'm an aircraft pilot. My wife and I work for the same airline. Uh. Oh, and I thought you might have been cosplaying. So what does your airline want with you on your day off? It's not actually my day off. I'm on standby, which means I'm supposed to be waiting at home. But now another pilot has called out sick and I have to go in. It's a plane full of people who need me. Right. And I take it you're not supposed to go out to dinner while you're on standby? <sighs> nope, not ever. 
But my, my, my wife insisted, okay? You know how it is with married people. Sorry, I'm single. Figures. But my wife's birthday slipped my mind. What else was I supposed to do? Uh, I don't know, file a sick leave? Let an irresponsible guy like this fly airplanes? Scary. <laughs> Very dangerous! <laughs> yes! Well, it sounds like you're going to have a bite going to have to bite the bullet and tell your wife you're going to work. Yeah, she's getting pretty belligerent, huh? My travel schedule's bad enough, but if I break it to her that I forgot her birthday too, my marriage is over! And it's gonna be even worse if you tell it while she's drunk. I was trying to find a way out of this mess and when you showed up. Not sure why you sighed with her, but I'm glad you did. <laughs> Voice at the same register as mine. Far from it, actually. If you were to wear my uniform, I don't like where this is going. Well, I'm going to ask anyway. Will you please take my place and have dinner with my wife? Whoa, 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 they're back it up. Anyway you slice it, switching places with you is cray cray. Would you prefer to fly a plane for me instead? Huh? Okay, now that's next level, stupid. Honey, did you fall in? <laughs> See, she's calling you. I'm sure you can handle a drunk woman until she passes out. Come on. Yes, come on. Let's just hurry up and exchange your contact info. <sighs> Here, it's a cheat sheet. It's my profile and a few important details about me. How's this evidence? And here, my license and a few other important knickknacks. Uh. Is this really necessary? And won't you need your license, my dude? <laughs> the devil's in the details in these situations, my friend. Okay, I'm gonna stop by my house and get a spare uniform so you can have this one. How far is your house again, bro? Now I look like I'm the cosplayer, really. <laughs> wow, I would trust you to fly a plane by just looking at you. That's a bad call. All right, we gotta get to work. Good luck. Oh, by the way, that air that plane is actually headed towards the Orb Union. So if I don't make it out alive, you have to be the one to be to make the baby with her for me. Excuse me, what? Very well. Eh? I must go. Maida, how may I be with you? Whoa, wait! Honey! I can see you! Come have a seat! Crap, this is really happening, isn't it? Worst birth worst birthday ever! Here goes. But I guess I better study this client's cheat sheet real quick. Alright. Case file. Side cases. Where is it? Worst birthday ever. Uh, where is it? Worst. Oh, there we go. Found it. Okay, cheat sheet. I'm gonna take a cell. I'm gonna take a snippet of this. Okay, there we go. Cheat sheet attained. So, okay, Bayo says, a note from Tatsuro about his wife written hastily on a receipt. It reads, Tatsuro Tanaka, 34, now Ko Tanaka, 33, met in a Yakiniku store right here. Mom's a nurse, is in England. That's in, that's dead. Naoko's a bad drunk, no sake for her. Has a smelly f Was that detail necessary? <laughs> At bag the Tatsuro forced on me. There's a lot of junk in this thing. Does he not need it for work? Yeah, like his license? Jesus Christ, monkey dicks. Uh, hey, sweetie. Sorry uh, I took so long. Mm. Ah. Mm. No, 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 look closer. Uh-oh. It's gonna be over before it began. <laughs> Have you gotten more uh, handsome lately? You're 
Dead muffin? Eh? Oh, uh, you really think so? <laughs> so, what was that on the phone, honey? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, uh, that. My younger brother, the captain, my dead father. <laughs> Guys, do you guys? All right, I know she's drunk. We can basically toy around with this. Do you want me to pick the father? Does he, have brother? he has no brother. Okay, he only has a sister. So, do we give the right answer, which is the captain, or do we give the stupid answer that it's the that it's the dead father calling us on the phone? I'm waiting for you guys to call. Do we give? Do we make Yagami say that the one on the phone is his dead father? Or do we just be straight and say it's the captain? Remember, she's drunk. <laughs> Please be honest. <laughs> Wait on the other's responses. Join soccer, father for content. <laughs> okay, ruining his fate. It was my father from from the heavens above. What? Then whose funeral or were we at last year? Eh? Uh, uh, oh, oh, wow. Uh, yeah. Uh, that was him. Totally dead. <laughs> he called using the heavenly hotline. One eight hundred three sixteen. The heavenly hotline. My word, technology has so gotten so good these days. Just how drunk is she? I'm gonna give the Chi-Chi another look before I really screw something up. Oh, she bought. Okay. <laughs> okay, definitely we can. You know what? Let's just go over all the bad choices. It was my little brother. Since when do you have a little brother? Uh, oh, uh, do I not? No, you don't. No one I've ever met. You feeling okay, honey? Sorry, I guess that's the uh, alcohol is getting to. <laughs> Her father warned in heaven. <laughs> Thanks a lot, chat. <laughs> well, pull yourself together. <laughs> Who's gonna take care of me if you're prickled too? Alright, fine, let's come in clean. It was the captain. Huh? The captain? He won't call that asshole! Oh no, it was fine. Uh, he just, uh, ass dialed me. Is that so? Or could it have been that woman? Woman? What, what, uh, what, what, what woman? Don't you play dumb with me! Whoa! I saw you! You were having fun in the shopping spree with a flight attendant yesterday! A real young piece of ass! Eh? Uh, I was? You're a terrible husband! Terrible man! <laughs> what a deplorable man! Scum! Scum, I'd say! Scum! Great, I'm a I'm at dinner with a drunk one who's not even my wife, and I'm apparently cheating on her. Cool. Ah, oh, now, sweetie, uh, let's not make a scene here. Uh, I've made terrible life choices. Well, drinking over much three bottles for one is a terrible life choice here, lady. <laughs> oh, man. 
should be blasted to the moon, vaporized by Requiem. Uh, at least she's calming down. They're uh, having technical difficulties with a plane, so I'm off the hook. Heading back now. Oh, thank God. Oh no! <laughs> huh? Yagami Kun? Ma for you? Yagami Kun? Who is this? What's with the outfit? Are you cosplaying as a pilot? Is, is Comic Con already happening? Come on, throw me a bone here. I thought we were going there together with Saori and Hoshino. Yagami Kun? This woman a friend of yours, honey? Huh? Honey? Uh, yeah. Uh, about this. What business do you have with my husband? You're another one of his hussies? Uh, husband? Yagami Kun, is there something you want to tell me? Um. Chotto. Honey? Let's hear it! Explain this to me right now! Yagami Kun, I swear to God! If you ever make this up, I swear if everything that we had together was a lie, I am gonna learn how to tiger drop your ass! Not you too, Moff, you- Yes! Sauri taught me! Sauri told me everything! Did I sign to Moff you that I'm undercover? Or would Nako catch on? She probably would. What should I say Moff you is to me? She's my stalker, she's my ex girlfriend, she got the wrong guy. <laughs> I'm gonna ruin this man's whole career! She's my ex. Oh! I. 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 I am? Wait, wait, wait no. Uh, I, uh. I'm sorry. Uh. Huh. I'm so confused right now. What's going on? No, 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 this lady, this lady is confused. <laughs> She's my stalker. What the hell, Yagami? Yagami-kun, are you? No, 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 I I'm just messing around. Whatever you're doing right now, Takayuki Yagami, I am absolutely lost. So, who is she? So, who is she then? She made a mistake. I'm not Yagami. Yeah, but... Ma'am, can't you see? We're in the middle of a meal here. Now, would you please leave us be until later, wink? Mafia, please tell me you got that. I remember this, the safe word, later. Or not. I see. That's how you're gonna go into act. That's how you're going to act, so be it. Uh, she didn't get it. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, what's up, Mafia? I'm ready to learn the tiger drop now. Sweet! I'll, I'll sign us up to the program. <laughs> She's drunker than you, actually. <laughs> I want a divorce! What? That woman from earlier! She's your side hussy, isn't she? That's who you were seeing, right? I bet she's a new flight attendant. No, 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 she's not, she's not, she's not. I'm going home! <laughs> uh, wait a minute, I'll explain everything. Explain what? Uh, 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 all right, bag. I need to get something to fix this. Anything. Hmm? This logo looks familiar. Oh, Louis Vuitton. It's, how did that fit in the? It's a recent date and time. She mentioned seeing him shopping with the flight attendant, so it's possible that I can prove I'm not having an affair now, Ko. It's. 
This cheat sheet! <laughs> Kidding, it's the paper bag. Showing her that right now would prove her husband she's having an affair. I mean, something that'll prove Tatsu. Alright, it's it's the cheat sheet. It's the cheat sheet, of course! Not like scratch paper, but it's actually a receipt. Aha! 32,000 yen for a bag! Oh, no, no, wait, 31,860. He paid 32,000 yen with 140 yen for change. See the date? That's the day you saw me shopping with that girl. True? Oh, what does that prove? Don't you see? Here's the store we shopped at. Yeah, it's a luxury store. You're spending our hard-earned money to get in her pants. No, here. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Huh? The truth is, I needed a lady's opinion on what kind of present to get you. I don't really know what the ladies are into these days. I'm a boomer. <laughs> so... Really? I'm sorry. I wanted it to be a surprise. You got me a birthday present? Oh, honey. How many years has it been since you've done that? Uh, I don't know, actually. But I think it means our love is real. It's true, my love. You're the only one I've ever loved before in my life. And the only one that I will ever get into those pants. And you're the only one I love until I die. Hey, this is it. This isn't the right time, bro. Huh? Why do I suddenly have two husbands? Ah, oh, crap. I think I'm... Yeah, you came in too early. I'm sorry about that. I came. Came. Is she dead? Ah, now go. I think that might have been a bit too much alcohol to handle, and maybe the visual psychological psych psychic drama. That's your son. Thank you. <sighs> wow, she's fast asleep. Yagami-san. Yagami-san, thank you so much. It was interesting, but I hope you'll talk it out more when she wakes up. Yeah, I plan on it. I've been putting my work above my marriage, and I see that now. Thanks to you, I think my wife's birthday turned out to be a great anniversary for us. Well, glad to hear it. I wish you and Nago long happiness, Tatsuro-san. Hi. Yes, tonight I will make it up to her. You know it. Thanks again. I will make it up to her by making her get into my pants. Ah, oh, crap. I forgot about Mafio. No, I'm the one in hot water. I better message her. Uh, sorry about earlier, Mafio. I was undercover and they said some things I shouldn't have. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have known better. I hope I didn't mess anything up for you. Wait, really? I'm just kidding. I knew you something was wrong, so... Don't worry. I forgive you, Yagami-kun. Okay, thank God. Wait, really? Thanks a, thanks a lot, Yagami-san. I'm black and blue and green all over. I was in the middle of a drunk side quest, Kim! Speaking of which, uh... Oh my god, they kept it on archive, yes! Yes! That was perfect! Moff, you and I bonded! But in the worst way possible. I think I just ruined my entire relationship with Moff, you. But anyway, time to ruin another girl's relationship by lying through my teeth, once again! Do we keep the pilot suit? Uh, let's see. Yes, we do, Sultan. Yes, we do. We kept the pilot suit. Oh, it's still on cooldown. Hello. Who are you again? I forgot who that guy was. Ow. 
Wait, double checking the map. Any new side cases? None? Okay. Parkour. Oh my god, we're matching. Hey, Yakumi san. Uh, hey there. Sorry to drag you out like this. Actually, I'm happy to help. I mean, we're going on a real detective case here. There's no way I'd pass that up. Oh, my sweet business casual attire. It looks so good on her. God damn it. Never knew business casual would look so hot. Uh, no. uh, what do you think? Do I look like I could be your girlfriend? Don't tease me, Nanami! It's perfect. Looks great on you. I'm glad I spent all the time getting dressed up. When did I give this to you again? On our first date, remember? Oh, that's right. Maybe we should give her a present. Yes! Nami-san, here's something I thought you would look good on you. Really? You sure? Yeah, I don't know if you'll like it or not, though. Aww, it's adorable! Thanks, Yagami-san. I'm glad she's happy with it. Do you have any problem acting like a couple? Well, I'm dressed right... I'm dressed as one right now, right? Hi. Not at all. In fact, I've been doing extensive mental preparation just for this. You sure seem excited. <sighs> well, an opportunity like this only comes down once in a blue moon. Is the target here yet? She should be showing up any minute now. What the hell, Yagami? I've been waiting for four straight hours! I had to go through ten smart burger orders! Ah, there she is. That's who you're looking for? Wow, she sticks out like a sore thumb. Huh? I feel like I've seen her around before. Maybe that's just your imagination. Yeah, you're probably right. Uh, I wouldn't stare too much at the target if I were you. Otherwise, she might catch on to us. Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. Avoid unnecessary eye contact. That's one of the basics of investigation. Roger that, sir. Nami knows Yuko well, so she might be able to recognize her even at a subconscious level. Oh god, it backfired. We should definitely keep our distance. Alright, so we're gonna do our best to follow her around without being noticed. Is this what you call tailing? Yep. Whatever actions we take from here on out, we need to be absolutely sure not to raise her suspicion. Looking at her face is especially off limits. Just look at mine instead. Wait, what? What? Uh, oh, damn it! There's no time to risk, Yagami! Look at her face. Hi. Uh, understood. I'll be careful not to mess things up. Oh, great. That's right, Stud Muffin! Follow me around. Yuko. Worse than not. Oh my god, she's joining us! Yeah, give me some, she's getting away! I know. Wait, how do we know if that's our target if we cannot see her face? Reasons! Okay, I'm hiding. Nanami, you go hide behind the vending machine. Okay, I will stand here. I will stand here perfectly obvious. Damn it! I'm making noise. No, no, no. Okay, good. She didn't spot me. What was that? Uh, that was uh, all part of the plan. Really? What? Oh. Ooh, I wonder what she's up to. Hmm? Who 
is that? Who is that girl I see? Staring right back at... Uh-oh! I think she's starting to notice us! I didn't ask her to go over the top like that! Go on! Do it! Do it! You know, she really does remind me of someone. Who could that be? Ah! This is not good! Intrusive thoughts help me! What are you doing? Shh! We need to pretend like we're a couple. Uh, right! Hmm? I don't see anyone following me. There's a cute young couple with matching black outfits making out in the middle of Tenkaichi Street. Why do you keep looking this way, Yuko? This is... This is getting kind of embarrassing. Are you going to be staring at us this whole time? Wait, hold on. Let me check up my phone. Alright, don't worry. I have it on my webcam. Hmm? What? Give her a big, wet, luscious kiss. Is that what she's trying to tell me? Be for it's too late? You know what to do, baby. Man, for a second there I thought it was all over. For a second there I thought I was all over! Yeah, our cover was almost blown, huh? Uh, right! Uh, that is what I meant! Uh, uh, Alright, let's go see what she's up to! Really? Really, Yagami? I gave you the opportunity and you waste it! Not my idea, Yuko! Come on! Spur of the moment! I am not mentally prepared for this! Well, neither am I! I thought you are the professional. I was faking it! How, we, how long are we going to stand behind this thing, Yagami-san? I mean, as if you're not standing behind anything at all. Sorry, first time, first try. Okay. We're, we're going inside M-Side Cafe. Wait, done? Think she's having a little rendezvous with her secret lover inside? Only one way to find out. Guess we'll have to play the waiting game. Alright, now's my chance to talk to her. Most of just waiting around, we might as well talk about something. That's what a normal couple would do. Why am I standing up? How are we. I th I think Yagami's bugged. <laughs> I want to say this earlier, but thanks for helping me out today. No problem. I've always wondered how detectives do their jobs, so I'm glad you let me tag along. And by the way, Yagami-san, why are you standing there in the middle like you're obviously staring at our target? Well, you need to have good peripheral vision to see everything from left and right. You have to see if there are si if there are people passing by, people are planning to take you out, and of course, to make sure that your target is up there 24-7. Oh, so that's how you guys do it. Yep. Besides, people who cheat should be punished. It's pretty disrespectful, I'll say that much. Sad thing is, I see it happen over and over again in this line of work. Why do you think that is? Uh... It's the trappings of the male sex drive. <laughs> Simple. It's the trappings of the male sex drive. The male sex what now? Your sex drive? I yeah, I'm talking about our survival instinct. The more we procreate, the greater chances of passing down our dna. The instinct fuels the sex drive, so cheating is more of a physical factor than an emotional one. 
So what you're saying is, men can't help it if they cheat? That they should be excused for it? Uh, no, I didn't mean it that way. <laughs> We're all just animals deep down. <laughs> I wouldn't say that. After all, you can't let things like instinct and desire rule your life. Even though it's biologically coded in your system? Yeah, for example, finding yourself attracted to other women does happen. Even if you do have a partner. But when you consider the love and trust you built together, submitting to the drive is entirely out of the question. Mm -hmm. I thought men couldn't control their natural instincts. Well, nobody's a saint. I doubt many people have the willpower to resist temptation in the heat of the moment. <laughs> I can't imagine this outside. Kaito. Yeah, like you talk? Oh, shut. Kaito! On top of that, it's difficult to stay enamored with your partner. That's only the first phase of something much deeper. Wow, Yagami with a real talk. That's why you need to think seriously when getting into a relationship and put a lot of effort into maintaining it. Mm, I kind of understand what you mean. I guess men are more complex than I give them credit for. <laughs> well, from a guy's point of view, women are much more complex. <laughs> but then I guess the feeling is mutual. Okay, you know what? Let's unbug Yagami. Oh, yeah, while we're at it, while I'm standing here, quite obviously, why don't we take a pic together? <laughs> for old time's sake? <laughs> sure, why not? Wait, can I? Can we turn around and actually focus on our target? Red, blues, verdant, ruby, paradox, sapphire, nostalgic, dawn, sunset, smoky, moody, emotional damage. Kidding. Ice cold, scorching, melon. Uh, two bit red. There we go. None. Uh. I went through the. Oh, come on, come on, me. Wait, alright, Ben. There we go. Okay, now we're fixed. So are you done? Are you finished standing around? Yep, I'm already tired. Let me take a seat. Let's see how it turned out. Hmm, look good. I'll send this to her later. So, um, I've noticed we haven't really gone out in a while. Is it that is it that I'm getting in the way of your work? What? No no no, that's not it. Is she not just avoiding me? Wow, Yagami throwing it down. Hey, I have been really busy. I mean it. Take a step back and apologize. Push gently for a follow-up date. Be a mental gen or be aggro about it. Guys, I'm leaving Yagami's Yagami's hands to you. Do we take a step back and apologize or push gently for a follow-up date to compensate the emotional damage? Why do you guys decide? I'm gonna be honest with you. Nanami's character model has some really beautiful eyes. Beautiful eyes, like I heard from my brother before. Waiting on the answers, guys. Wait. Yeah, I'm waiting on the answers. So, again, repeating the question. Do we take a step back? Okay, push. Push. I got a push. I got one for push. Anyone following up? Let me just take a bite. Going once. Going twice. We'll push it. I understand. But if there is ever a time you and I can go out... Please let me know. Uh, is I guess I could make some time, provided all my work gets done. But why ask me so directly? Well, I heard from Yuko-san that you've been turning down every guy who's asked you out. And I guess I didn't want you to think of me as just some 
guy. Just another heartbreaker. No, I would never think that ever. Because Yagami san, I think you're special. You do? Hi. You saved my life. And you're constantly surpassing my expectations. No one else is like that. So you don't automatically hate me, but can you see me as a love interest? Oh my god, there is! I'm raising it! But can you see me as a love interest? Well, I wouldn't outright reject you. I don't think you're a pre and I do think you're a pretty good guy. Did you did you just stutter? No no no, a slip of the tongue. I really mean it. I really mean you are a pretty good guy. Ah. <sighs> And I'm glad you think it that way. Sorry if anything I said rubbed you the wrong way. Nami-san, has anyone cheated on you before? Yagami, you know this is a bad thing to talk about. What did we learn? We never talk about a girl's past. But then again, that is like self-conflicting because we also wanted to know their history so that you know what not to do and how to treat her better. There was this guy I dated. Uh-huh. I loved him from the bottom of my heart, you know. I would have done anything for him. But he ended up cheating on me like I was like it was no big deal. Called it a moment of weakness, douchebag. So that's what happened. Yeah. I was still young and naive. So it felt like my whole world was centered around him. I was an idiot for trusting him. Even though it happened so long ago, it still stings. What can I possibly say to that? This one is too generic. Okay? Miyogi real talk time. I'm sorry you had that experience is the most generic thing you could ever say. You can say that to someone you barely know if they share, if they open up. You can easily just let them, you can just easily say that and move on to the next topic. But if it's someone as special as like the one you take, a person you take interest in, it's not enough that you say you're sorry. It's not enough that you're sorry that they have to go through that. But at the same time, I would also say, if you don't say anything, it would also question the other person. Are you even listening? Uh, wait, what did I say in Nanami's voice? It would also question the other person. Are you even listening? Did you understand what I am, what I am telling you here? I am opening up to you, so say something, God damn it! That would normally be what the other person would say in reaction to that reflex. But at the same time, you don't want to sound like some broken record. Uh, no. Tired of me yet? No, not at all. In fact, I'm glad you shared that with me. <sighs> I thought I'd completely forgotten about it. And here I am. Lost in an awful memory like it was only yesterday. I feel bad now. Oh, God, no, wait, that's, that's Yagami. God damn it, I feel bad now. What did we learn, Yagami? No, it's not your fault, Yagami-san. I'm letting this stay in the past so it doesn't bother me anymore. Or at least, it shouldn't bother me. Maybe I'm not really over it. What am I doing around messing with this girl? Is that why you haven't had a boyfriend for a while? Oh my god, do we come clean? Ah, personal dilemma. Do we, do we gaslight ourselves with the guilt? Or do we continue the conversation as if this is nothing? Chat, help me out here. I want this to be interactive.
Ga <laughs> Gaslight yourself. <laughs> So, like I've mentioned before, I'm not interested in dating anyone. But at the same time, I feel like I'm burying myself in work in order to hide from my past. At least, Yuko thinks so. Then, if you met someone that was right for you, would you give that person a chance? Yes, I would. If someone like that even existed. You haven't met anyone like that yet? <sighs> Who knows? <laughs> I see you're dodging the question. I hate myself right now! What are we do- What are we doing false- um, Dragging this girl into a false sense of security? I feel really bad now. Thanks, Yuko. <sighs> I never imagined I would open up my past to anyone, let alone a guy. Well, I'm glad you did. Because now I feel like I got to know you a bit better. Hi. I feel like I got to. I feel like I got to know you too. Did your impression of me change at all? Yeah. Nope. Still the same. I still think you're a wonderful person. Thanks for being so understanding. Ah, crap. I hate myself so much right now. I nearly fell off my chair. I'm sorry, guys. Um, hey, Yagami san? What's up? I think our target's watching us. Oh. Oh, uh, oh, right. I completely forgot. Did you kiss yet? Did you give her that big, wet, luscious, moist kiss? I know you do. I know you want to, Yakami. Do it. Just do it. I will give. I will make sure everything is recorded on my phone. Did we get caught? Don't tell me. She wants me to get more physical. Yes, that's right. Get in there. Get in there. Put your back into it, Yagami. Throw your literal body all over Nanami. <sighs> all right. In order to throw her off, we're going to have to do something only a couple would do. Hmm, I wonder what that could be. How about a little kiss? Will you feed me something? Mmm! Very dangerous choices! I gotta vote for left! Anyone who's gonna counter? <laughs> then how about a little kiss? Huh? Excuse me, what the hell? No way! Come on, it's to pretend we're a couple, right? <sighs> we'll be purely platonic. Not the good. Kissing is absolutely out of bounds. Fine then. How about will you feed me something? Okay, say we got zoned on that one. <gasps> You want me to feed you? Yeah, lovers feed each other all the time. <sighs> Great, now I got flash I got momentary flashbacks. Thanks a lot, Yagami. Now I'm gonna quote the same thing that that Nanami said earlier. I thought I'm over it. It turns out I wasn't. Thanks, Yagami. Oh no. All I have this is coffee spoon though. I'm sure she can tell from this distance. Alright then, here goes. Here comes the choo-choo train! 
Uh, hold on. Oh. Yeah, give me something right. I think. I think the spoon went into my throat. Oh, I'm, oh my god, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Let me help you. Oh. <coughs> Are you okay? Are you okay, Yagami? Here, here, have some of my coffee. No, no, no. It's okay. I got it. All good. I, I think I deserve that. Honestly, <laughs> that was so embarrassing. Yeah, you and I, me both. <laughs> But <laughs> we managed to throw her off suspicion. Oh. oh, so it seems. Hey, baby. Oh, hey, baby cakes. Oh, oh, oh. isn't that her secret lover? Probably. Why do we take a picture just in case? Oh, no. Can I take the picture? Uh, sure. Just don't get too close. I'll make sure I won't freak. I won't get found out. Yeah, now you gotta turn off the shutter, right? I don't know how. All right, picture perfect. Hmm? I swear I've seen this face before. Uh, maybe she looks like someone famous. Ah, you might be right. <sighs> well, we managed to get what I needed, so I think that's all for today. We did it without getting caught. Ah, uh, seriously. And I thought we, though we did have a few close calls, didn't we? Mm -hmm. We did. Oh wait, right, we did. You were talking about the case, right? Yeah. Thanks for coming, Nanami-san. We managed to get some solid evidence. <laughs> of course! I was definitely thrilled to do it. I've never done anything remotely like this before. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Even though we were acting, it still made my heart a flutter. Was it like that for you too? Yeah, yeah. definitely. <laughs> It's been a long time since I felt this excited about something. You know, I really enjoyed having you along today. Let me know when you have any new investigations, okay? I'd rather investigate some things we can do together. Are we only allowed to hang out if it's work if work is involved? <sighs> oh! This entire relationship arc is PTSD! Thanks, Yagami! It's like 2023 is haunting me right now. Thanks a lot! Actually, I'd rather investigate some things we can do together. I want to get to know you, Nanami-san. On a more personal level. Hi. Truthfully, I want the same thing. Wait, wait, really? <laughs> I learned so much about you today. Aside from your skills as a detective. <laughs> so what I'm trying to say is... I'd also like to spend more time with you. Great. I seem to have a pretty good chance here, don't I? Does that mean our next date will be a real one? <laughs> I guess it would. Well then, I'll give you a call sometime. Hi. Okay, I'll be waiting. But if it's another investigation, you know I'm all in for it. God damn it! Hey, Yagami-san. I wanted to thank you for the valuable experience today and for listening to me. No, thank you for cooperating with me. Did you report your findings to the client? Yeah, I did. Stop with the lies, man! And? Are they going to split up? Not sure. I'm leaving that up to the client to decide. Well, they better be! I see, so you don't step in that deep. But I think it's better to break up with someone who cheats on their partner. 
When you find out it happens, please tell me. Please spill the tea for me, Yagami. I feel bad right now. Hey, yo, what? So, how's everything going with Nanami? Good, I hope. So far, so good. I think she'll probably go out with me again. Yay, so our plan worked. I still feel bad lying to her, though. Really, what gave it away? You won't do anything bad, Yagami-san. Besides, I pushed you to do this. And I agreed to it, which makes me equally responsible. Well, what's more important is what happens next. That's right. You gotta ask her out. Get in there. You gotta go in deep. Great. What is this? Stockholm Syndrome? Which way do I go now? Oh, wait, right. Where is that thing that, uh... It's chapter 8, right? So let me just double check the wiki so that we can easily progress to main story. Judge chapter 8. Okay, let me find it here. Uh, Matsugane family office, since they've been mighty quiet recently. Matsugane family office. I think it's just right across, is it? Uh, where is the family office again? There's one right next to us, right? Right? No, wait, that's Children's Park. Where's Matsugane family office again? Ah, okay, Higashi. Of course. Of course, it had to be Higashi. Oh, also, our Ezio flight is there. You know what, screw it. I'm taking a cab. No, 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 Sultan. You guys aren't responsible for this. If anything... It's the group that is responsible. They kind of forced me into, you know, ruining the bond that I had with her. And I agreed to it, which makes it equally worse. They pushed me. And I agreed to it. That's what makes it bad, right? That's why I'm saying this whole Nanami thing is PTSD. Is it actually here? Oh, it's you know what? Wait, before we, we do main story, I have to find the clock. Oh, where, where is it? Where? Ah, where? Where? Where is the client that needs their door picking? So the client that needs their door pi Ow! Okay, that's it. Dance! Wait, I'm collecting heat first. Okay, that's it. Guys, good night. Master Yagaba, you gotta show me that technique. Never. I've been waiting for you. Can you open this door for me? Okay, fine. Let's see. Oh, okay. I prefer this over the thumb turn bypass, honestly. Yes. And no timer. Nice. Yes. 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 And besides, she admitted it to me herself. 
I would have I had a huge chance. So that was the similarity between the Yagami Nanami and the uh, Miyogi and M moment. That's why again PTSD. For good or for bad, PTSD is PTSD. Okay, now let's enter Charles and continue main story. Time to talk to the person behind the way of the house husband. なんだよ。今、ただ、綾部のこと、星野君から聞いたぜ。モグラにはめられたらしいって。結局何につけてもモグラが鍵なわけか。ああ。だからまずはそのモグラと繋がってるハムラの頭だ。そこから攻める。地道にね。親父が頭の居場
take it. Thanks, bro. Hey, what kitchen it is first then? Okay, one for me and one for my friend here, please. He's not here. Why were you waiting? I don't like wet kitchen talk. How about we try Smile Burger instead? Wait, isn't there another Smile Burger in another branch? Wait, hold on. Let me just check. Uh, Oh my god, unable to progress? Really? Really now? The guide says, walk around for a while with Kaito beating people up. <laughs> cool. So we really have to beat people up. Can we send people to Brazil? Anyone? Anyone here who wants to be sent to Brazil? Hello? Guys? Come here to be sent to Brazil! It's a free pass! A free ticket! Ow! <laughs> oh come on! That was payback for last time, bro. Okay, fine, whatever. See, what else we could do? How many people have we beaten up already? Game says Higashi will call us after we beat people up. I forgot I have this. Oh, come on, Kaito. At least it wasn't Sakakiba's group. Oh, wait, right. Forgot I, I could bond with this guy right here. Apparently, all friends suddenly disappeared as soon as we just, you know. Wait for something to happen. You know what? Let's go around Nakamichi here. How long must we wait? Uh, Kaito, can we stop by the office a sec? I need to pick something up. Yeah, sure, bro. This isn't your office street. Oh, uh, yeah, good point. How long does it take for Higashi to make the call? I don't know. Or more like how many people do we need to beat up before Higashi calls? I don't know. Oh, this smile burger. Oh, there it is. もしもし。まずがね、組の東だ。ああ。親さんどうだった。愛想か。カムロキクノヤって料亭がある。町からちょっと外れた隠れ家だよね。そこにタクシーで行け。親父はもう行ってる。カムロキクノヤだな。あん
<laughs> Bro, you just walked straight into that cab more than once. You can take it, Kaido. I know you can. Talk, what the hell, you dick? Get back here. Guys, run! It's a rampaging gorilla! <laughs> Are you okay, Kaido? Oh. どうぞ。お座りください。しばらくだな、ターボ。はっ。カイトは組み上げて以来か。へい。おやさん。東から聞いただろうけど、俺らが聞きたいのは、その前に乾杯くらいしようじゃねえか。な確かに。<笑> どうぞ。なんだって。ハムラ親父。いつの間にこんな。ターボ。断ると どうしても引かねえってんなら、しばらく動けねえ体になってもらう。それで死なずには済む。おやっさん。これが最初で最後だ。お前らはしばらく町を出てろ。少しでも俺に恩を感じてるなら。この頼みだけは聞け。モグラの剣は創薬センターとも絡んでる。3年前の大久保事件と繋がってきてんだ。いくらおやさん
親父の命令は俺にとって絶対でしたでも俺は今八神探偵事務所の人間です We're civvies, Dad. ああそうだなおやっさん東へへい腹くくれてめえはマスガネの人間だなもちろんですえいよ証明しろバカ野郎なんて顔してんだもうやるしかねえんだやるしかねえって時は殺す気でかかってこいそれが男だ今そんな説教するかね Really Kaido? He needs it bro Trust me 行くぞら Leave their one on one B, man. I'm letting Higashi have his moment with talk. Matsugane Family Tojo Clan, Toru Higashi. When I first saw this in Nico B's playthrough, I called him Discount Majima. Oh, wait, forgot dance. Okay, I'm good. Ow. Sorry, guys. I know you don't want to do this. I forgot I can't grab anyone. Talk, what the hell? Stop dancing, man! I can't help it, Kaido! It's the abstract! Okay, that just leaves a 2v1 between Higashi and I. Talk! Stop dancing right now! See, even Higashi thinks it's stupid of you to do so. <laughs> nice tag team, bro. Hey, no problem, bro. Okay, finisher. Sorry, Higashi. Bro, I think you just drowned my bro. You done? Sorry for the mess, old man. I just went out and took a leak.
これだけの極道相手にそれに比べて腐っちまったよ俺はなあそうじゃねえか多忙初めてお前と会った頃とはもう違うよなおやっさんいい加減しつけんだよそばけ Twenty years ago? まだ終わってねえぞおおやってるなカイトあっおやじそいつが例の矢神とかいうおおもう顔合わすたびにこれですわ What is what's gonna look like? What to say? おめえカイトに殴られんのがよっぽど好きらしいな何回やられてもしつこく結果を打ってくるどっか行かれちまってんのか<笑>どこも行かれてねえよクソヤクザ<笑>クソヤクザと来たか少年の腐ったガキだな腐ってんのはお前だろ生きがってんじゃねえぞ小僧実は俺にもお前さんみてえな時期があってよやけになってムカつくもん見境なく殴りまくったもんさそしたらよいつの間にかこのゴミためみてえな町にしか居場所がなくなってたおめえもそんなとこじゃねえのかうるせえ分かったら口聞いてんじゃねえわかるんだよ俺には若い頃から取り返しのつかねえ失敗を繰り返してきたからなだからよ<笑>おめえも同じだと一目でわかる違うか俺は気づいた時にはもうヤクザになるしかなかっただが今のおめえの年なら猿にはまだ早いさっきゴミためみてえな街って言ったがよ本当は違うこの街はどん底を知った上でそこから這い上がろうとする人間があがく場所だもしお前にその気があるなら今度そこんとこじっくり教えてやるだからよもう二度とうちの怪盗に喧嘩うんじゃねえぞに酒がまずいなお前らがモグラって呼んでるのはハムラが抱えてるコルシアだコルシアああハムラは殺しが必要な時は決まって同じ人間を使ってるみてえだきっとそいつだろう誰なんだそいつはさあなただどっから見つけてきたのか相当のもんだ同じ手口で何人もやってんのにろくな証拠も残してねえおやっさんがモグラの顔を見たことはねえよモグラの顔を知ってんのはハムラだけだタボお前どうしても手引かねえ気かええ、だがもしハムラやモグラを追ったとこで奴らも道具に使われてるだけだその奥に顔も見えねえ影みてえな連中がいるそんなもんに手出したらもう引き返せねえお前らそれが分かってんのか後悔するなら
やるだけやった後にするよ<笑>年寄りの忠告ってのはいつもそうやって無視されんだ親父申し訳ありません親父さん一つだけ言わせてもらえますかなんだ俺が知ってる松金組は殺しを平気で容認するような組じゃなかった羽村あっての松金組っていうのはやっぱり俺は何度も言わせんじゃねえ時代が変わって今の松金組は羽村の仕切りだ Then call it the 羽村ファミリー一切口出しはしねえ俺が組長として決めたことだ親さん今までお世話になりました That's the most formal way of saying I am ending ties right now by saying thanks for everything Oh my god, I just noticed those wheels aren't moving. Hamura no Ibasho wa wakarana watta na. Mata ichi kara shikiri naoshi da. Iya. Oyaji no hanashi no naka ni hinto wa atta ze. So ka? Hamura atte no matsugane gumi ってやつだ. Hmm? Sugata keshita tsutte mo Hamura ga jishitsu toppu nara yatsu ga inakia kumi no shinogi ga maara nee koto mo aru. ってことはどこかで組の門とやり取りしてるはずだもしその声を拾えりゃ多分羽村の居所も終えるつまり俺の言いたいことわかるか盗聴しようってことか例えば組の事務所おおよ True でも lead us straight to 羽村でもあんなところに盗聴器仕掛けるってあれだけ暴れちまったんだ捕まったらマジで殺されるぞああだからうまくやるには窃盗団張りの腕がいるなああなるほど杉浦にやらせるのか杉浦には俺から連絡しとくその代わりお前は盗聴器の手配だえせいぜいいの探せよ手に入れたら事務所で合流だ We can't afford to do this half-assed. This technology I need to I need to come with the guy. But he's over this bed he's over this usual hunt. Right, theater square it is. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna cap it. Alright, I'll probably end the stream in between 15 to 20 minutes from now, so we still got some time to progress further. Also, again, apologies for the stream quality. It's the network provider right now. So we're not enjoying this episode, no matter how great it is, uh, in 60 frames. I really bet it's going to be running at 30 frames uh, per second at the moment. Yo. Yagami, what's up? あまり大きな声じゃ言えないんだけどさ盗聴器が欲しいんだつくもそういうの詳しくない<笑>詳しいに決まってるでしょ僕を誰だと思ってるんですかだよな材料さえ揃えばすぐ作れますぞ材料ってお前の手作りメイドインつくもこれ以上信頼できる製品はありませんぞ Did he just say made in Tsukumo? What came to my mind was made in Ohio. Omake ni otomodachi kagaku desu kara. Wakatta, makaseru yo. De tochoki no zairyo ってのはすぐ集めてくる。そんなことする必要はありませんよ。ここにはないがここで手に入る。その心は。なんだそれ。ネット通販です。お急ぎ便でしたらあっという間に届きますから
八神氏はお金だけ用意してくだされいくら材料費と僕の手間賃込みで10万ほどあればそれでお友達価格なんだよな<笑>もちろん赤字覚悟の大特価ですとも<笑>じゃあ了解ではお金が用意できたら声をかけてくだされ必要なパーツは手配しておきます Yeah, I bought the money, Sukumo here. I'm gonna give you some interest. お金、準備できたのですかな材料費と手間賃込みで10万円ですぞ。ああ、これで頼む。I'm loaded. <laughs> Have some extras. では、完成したら連絡いたしますゆえ、ちょっとばかしお待ちくだされ。わかった。よろしく。Okay, time to see how fast Sumo Sukumo actually does this. What can we do within the next 5 10 minutes? And then suddenly you just take a few steps and Sukumo's already done. <laughs> Wait, you know what? While we're here, is it Blood Kitchen or is it Smileberg? Ah,、oh, the sushi shop! Down the road, down the lane, down the road. Who else have I not befriended in this place? It's usually cafes. Oh, wait, right, the doctor down below. The one which has the biggest、uh, jump scare moment in Judgment happened here. Wait, right. Here first.、Mm -hmm. Those eyes. They're deeper than the c a m a r o c h o sewers. Get brighter than tra trash in a bonfire. Just who are you? I'm Yagami. Can I help you with something? Depends. Let me introduce myself first. I'm Morio Onodera. Tell you, buddy. When you spend as much time below the pipes as me, you stumble across some strange things. <laughs> Dealing in such odds and ends is what I do for a living.、Mm -hmm. Got anything worth looking at? How about a talisman that boosts your luck at the casino? And that's just for starters.、Mm -hmm. Why would I want to make something like that? Sounds pretty sketchy. I see. So, what's your asking price? <laughs> sure. I ain't have the money. What do you mean? You have to make a living somehow. That's where you're wrong. I chose this lifestyle because I don't want to be tied down to the filth of the world above. They call it the Almighty Coin, but I say it's the root of all evil. The value now is XP.、Mm -hmm. Go on. We have people talk about their life experiences and give them something based on what they say. You guys tell me you've gone through quite a lot in your young life. I bet you got some amazing stories to tell. Oh, SP!、Boy. How about it? Like having a sit down? I could do that. <laughs> Perfect. It's what I have in stock right now. Oh, great. Oh, so these are the cheat items. I see. Fishing float,、uh, Bobber's decoration, golden tuna cat food. Meow, 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 meow. Fine. White the room,、uh, okay. These ones will need. What's with the triple yokan though? This was a cheat sheet, ten ten one, in Oichokabu. Basics of Shogi, this is a cheat sheet as well. And、uh, the Nine Gate style, it's the cheat sheet, cheat item for Mahjong.、Uh, I don't want the rubber baseball though and the soccer ball. I'm gonna get one of these. And these. <laughs> I knew you were one of a kind. What an incredible story. Can't wait to hear more. You didn't hear anything, man. You didn't hear anything from me. Yeah. Ah, Yagami san. Thanks for the other day.、Whoa. No sweat, Moriboshi sensei. Good to see ya. I know. So, you used to be part of a med uni? What was that like? That was a long time ago. Thinking back on it now, I can't believe I got swept up in all the bullcrap. All I ever thought about was how to get tenured, even at the cost of the people around me. 
Didn't trust anyone. After I left the hospital and ended up on the streets, these folks were the only ones who showed me any kind of dignity. They've been taking care of me ever since. Wow, I had no idea. Hmm? Muraboshi sensei Well, we need a doctor! What's wrong, Hamanaka-san? It's Kondo-san! He got into an accident! <gasps> what? We're bringing him here right now! So can you take a look? I'm on it. Uh... Alright. I've done everything I can. But we don't have enough blood for a proper test- Oh. Can we just use expanders? Yagami-san! Yagami-san! I have a favor to ask. Okay. Sure thing. What is it? We need people who can donate type O blood to Kondo-san. Several of them. Okay, I'll ask around the homeless community. Yagami-san? Yeah? I'm going to ask around the Champion District. So could you take care of Public Park number 3? Public Park 3. Got it. Only homeless, right? Yep. Okay, easy. Alright. I am on a fetch quest. I am given the list of items that I will be made to fetch. It would be funny if I do this sub-quest while dressed up as Dracula. It would be perfectly accurate. So is it a children's park? I'm gonna be coming to public park number three and that is... Where? I forgot. Bisupan. Uh, wait, let's see, hold on. Search. Public park number three. I think I'm lost. Yeah, that's children's park. Where is public park number three? Damn it. No. Unless you guys are willing to donate your blood for me. The chasing lets me know that that's a no too. Okay, fine. Catch! <laughs> Children's Park is. Uh, where was the. Here? I think. I just said this part though. Also, I'll need to keep an eye out for any restaurants or people. Damn it! Wait, wait, wait. Grab. Home run. You are a big guy, Ryan. Today's the day, old man. Time to pay them juice. Better do what Anika tells you while he's still in a good mood. I understand. Do what you want, but why would I let you try a new dessert instead? We don't need your mashup all bean crap. Oh, yes, we do. I love me some traditional desserts. Huh? Aniki. Excellent! A special bean paste is the pride of a store, so I definitely recommend it to anyone else who likes sweets. Ah! Uh, Zen! I know just what I want. Keep it together, Niki. Mm -hmm. Don't tell me. This was our Razzi Takamitsu again? Sucks to be him! <laughs> nah. I say you guys still haven't learned your lesson. Lesson? Wait, aren't you? The guy who kicked your ass? Yep. Ah, I thought something like this might happen, so I brought five of my toughest boys along with me. 
They all have matching red coats. You said five, I only count four. Now it's time for some sweet, sweet revenge. And after that, some actual sweet, sweet treats. Mm. So actually, is that you? Ow, ow, ow. Oh, wait, this will solve all our problems. Wait, no, no. Gimme. Ah! Okay, this would make things way easier. Get close. this possible quality over quantity buddy no matter how many goods you throw at me they're still gonna end up lying on the ground if i were you i'd take your sweets and get lost oh well okay maybe i will oh uh, so you forgot the sweets yeah. you really did the number in those fellas again just doing my thing mind i have your name so i can thank you properly i'm um, talking yagami I appreciate your intervention, Yagami-san. I'm sorry it's not much, but please take this. It's one of our newest confections. Ooh. It looks good. Thanks. No, thank you. I just hope this doesn't happen again. I have to save you four more times. Seriously. Well, I'll see you around. Okay. Last 10 minutes before we end, and... Oh wait, I gotta report to Ezio. Right. I went to look for Children's Park 3, I ended up looking for Ezio instead. Oh wait, now I remember, it has Popo right next to it. Hi, Benny. Looks like it went smoothly, Yagami. I got a call from the client just now. Managed to do it somehow. Well, here's your pay for today. It's chump changed as always. Now do me one last favor and we'll be besties. You're pretty good at what you do. I'll be counting on you again. Oh, you want to do one last job? Give me a girl. Here is a girl. Uh, it's in the class location. I hope she's hot. I, I definitely think she is. And that last key is around... Right behind the store. Good job, Ezio. Not Ezio Auditore. Why do I have to do it for you when they're just located right behind you? You said she's hot. Yes, I meant hot by senior citizen standards. Oh god, you must be the locksmith. Please, can you get this open? Mm. Okay, great. I start from the end as always. Yes. 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 You're so talented, thank you. No sweat. Take care now. Okay, the last one, Ezio, and we can finally be besties. I would I want to at least level up my city status just at least once. Hi, <laughs> Benny. Heard you did well, Yagami kun. You're shaping up to be one heck of a thief. I mean locksmith. Maybe even a professional. Huh, wouldn't say that. <laughs> Why don't you quit being a detective and make this your career? Ha! <laughs> I'm only joking. 
Well, here's your chump change for today. I'll be counting on you in the near future. Now I owe Tomioka's on a pretty hefty sum. But I need this cash to survive. New plan to pay her back someday. I'm sure she'll understand. Okay, good. We're best. So get the hell out of my shop. Okay, thanks for that maiden Tsukumo. I'm just gonna be collecting blood and I'm on my way there. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Sakakiba, no. Sakakiba, no. No Gohan for you today. Oh, it's the ah. Uh, there we go. Public Park Three. Now I see it. Oh my God, Rod! It's a pandemonium of gorillas. Excuse me, is anyone here ta blood type O? Huh? What's all this all of a sudden? The guy named Kondo got into an accident and needs a blood transfer fast. What'd you say? Conchan's hurt? My baby boy? My lover? My, my partner to be in life? Are you serious? Uh, yes. So, please? Is there anyone with blood O? I'm his type. I mean, I am type O. Great. Now, would you please come with me right away? Yeah, sure. Anything for my conchan. Okay. Let's get going. Uh. Alright. That should do it. That's a close one. Maraboshi Sensei, it's a you so much. Man, I'm so happy right now. I'm so happy for my lover to be alive and kicking. Thanks again, Yagami-san. Sorry to put you out like that. Hey, girl! We're besties, too! There's no trouble at all. Well, I need to thank you somehow. What? Find yourself injured. I'll treat you anytime. For free! Stop by whenever medicine alone won't do the trick. You're welcome here anytime. If you're suffering from fatal injuries, I'm your guy. I do have to charge you, though, of course. But you said it was free. I was only kidding. I have to make a living somehow. <laughs> Sounds like what just the doctor ordered. Oh. Indeed. Well then, I'll see you around. Great. Now we have to run away. Run all the way back just for public park number three. I mean, Theater Square. This is the road to Theater Square, right? Oh, it is. Oh, no, wait. This is the hotel district. What? Oh, god damn it. Uh, well, never mind. At least I'm kind of close. I'm pretty sure he can cure the pancreas. He's a professional medical pr medical practitioner. Oh, that one guy from the baseball thing. Right. I might do him off screen because it may involve... The baseball mini game, and I don't want that. And by the way, since there are two more girlfriend relationships to go over, I'm we're going to be finishing Nanami's relationship last for PTSD and way obvious reasons. Unless Sakino and the other girl kind of outshine her, which I doubt sure Sakino's like relatable but at the same time she's not my type おやがみし早かったですねお前の仕事の早さには負けるよ。お褒めに預かり光栄ですぞ。では商品をどうぞ。This <laughs> looks like a This looks like a plug adapter. I know. That's the whole point of it. コンセントに差し込み偽装するタイプのものです。受信範囲は100メートル、電波は超強力。間に鉄板のような遮蔽物があっても問題なし、ビルの上の方のフロアでもクリアに聞こえるでしょ。いいね。
そういうのが欲しかった電源はリモコンで遠隔操作できますから聞きたい時以外は電波の送信をオフにしてくだされたとえ八神氏のような名探偵であろうとこの盗聴器を見破ることは困難でしょうね<笑>なんか一言余計だなまあでもサンキュー助かったよ<笑>どういたしまして So if you need anything hacked, remember, Made in Sukumo! I honestly prefer Made in Ohio. You traitor! Okay, exactly on the dot. Once we get back to Yagami Detective Agency, we are also gonna be ending our life. Yeah, we'll finish the bond with the two lovebirds at the cafe later. I mean, next week. But for now, I'm also tired, so let's end our live. Hi, kids. I'm home. Domo. Ojama s t e m a s Teyuka. Muria l i t r e t e k o r a r a n d a k a d o Tojoki, t e n i h a i t e g a b t チリよしじゃあ座れよ。Okay, but can I stand? But can I stand first? Or more like, if I'm gonna sit, Kaito, I'm gonna do it in my lazy chair. No, no, I'm the leader of this operation. You sit in the baby chair. I sit on the lazy chair. I am the big kahuna. He's got you right there, Yagami san. God damn it. But anyway, before we start this operation, I'm at least say. I'm at least book this one first. Please find my son. My name is Ohata. I have an urgent request. I'll be waiting at Cafe Mihori at Nakamichi. Would you, could you please come? Please look for a man in glasses wearing a brown jacket with green pants. Sort of for the inconvenience. Thank you. Yeah, sadly, no, sorry for today, but I did try my best to、um, go over most of the main story. And unfortunately, main story does entail a lot of waiting, so we ended up doing side content at the same time. Ooh, Auber Ice! Right. Really talked to you, Gorge Dad out. I was saving that. Who gave it? The landlady. I was saving that Auber Ice for later, man. Well, you snooze, you lose, Kaido san. You took the chair, so I should at least get something in return. So I took the omrest. God damn you, ya talk. He's got you there, Kaido. Oh, shut up, Segura. Okay, so. Do, wait, you know what? I'm gonna stand right in between these two to make it at least look good. There. Alright, guys, so at this point, this is where I would be ending the live for tonight.、Um, just an announcement since I would be having, I'd be celebrating my parents' anniversary dinner quite early because their anniversary ends up on a weekday and we don't have time for a weekday. So we're gonna be doing it on a weekend. So, Infinite Wealth Stream will happen tomorrow later at. 8 or 9 p.m. between 8 to 9 p.m. because I'll be out on Sunday evening. And our objective for that one is we'll try to risk the last two girls before we continue with main story. And I know there's only a few more sub stories for Ichiban side. For next week, though, we're gonna continue main story on Judgment,、uh, try to progress as much as we could, and we're gonna be skipping anything relating to Nanami. Because we're still gaslighting ourselves for how bad of a potential boyfriend we turned out to be. I still hate the fact that we fooled her, and I also hated the fact that her history is similar to my ex's history. And you guys in the server know what I'm talking about. I'm not gonna hide the fact anymore that,、uh, that she's my ex, okay? And besides, She gave the go to green light. Even if she denies it in the end, she gave me consent in the end. So it's her fault for not remembering if, that's ha if that does happen. 
But yeah, I hope you love the moments with Giant Impact. I know it's going to be age restricted. Thanks a lot, GI. Um, but yeah, also um, upcoming offline videos. I'd like to let you guys know before we end. And upcoming offline videos we got are some more of Need for Speed the Run Challenge series. I already got them done. I just need to upload them. It they are serious run, so they won't have any soundtracks. Yes, Sultan, it's not your fault, okay? The only thing that you guys have be which I am grateful for is the one with the group. And part of the group is the one that egged me to do a thing that ruined the relationship the same way how Yuko egged Yagami into doing this horrendously horrible thing towards Nanami. Okay, so offline content we got is Need for Speed the Run challenge series. I'll also pull up the pull out the first episode of Need for Speed Carbon Redux and the next part of the Gundam Seed Destiny Rengu vs. Zaf 2 Plus. I made a teaser, a short few second teaser over on the Discord server. By the way, for those who have just arrived, remember we have a Discord server. Guys who are still right now here right now, please do help spread the server around to those interested or wants to be part of it. So yeah, I think those are about all of them. Oh, also my PC SX2 just got updated, so I double checked. Initial the special stage can be played now without the number plate bugging, so expect that one soon. And maybe C1 Grand Prix. No confirmed dates on the last two, but at least the first Initial mentioned ones, uh, initial mentioned ones, they're good. They will have their uh, confirmed uploads. But yeah, so just to note, it's probably we got Redux, we got um, the Run, and we got Rego versus Zaf Two Plus with mods. By the way, the last one has some mods, and there are mods that exist, and I updated them. But okay. Uh, that's it from me. Thank you so much for joining and I will see you guys later for Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth.